It is our segment on Wake Up Central where we continue to answer your questions big and small. Our question this morning comes from Brett in Clarksville. Can I take my eclipse glasses off during the minutes of totality? Well, Brett, that is a great question. One week from today, the sky will darken across much of Arkansas for the total solar eclipse. Arkansas Tech Assistant Professor of Physics Dr. Matthew Hankins and his team are ready for the big day. We've also recently got confirmed that like the Weather Channel is going to be here and several other uh, several other people have kind of been contacting us at the last minute, <laughs> you know, so uh, so yeah, excitement continues to build up to the moments of totality. You will need to be wearing those eclipse glasses. But what about the few minutes when the sun is not visible? Is it safe to remove your glasses? So say you live in a place where you are going to experience totality. If you leave your glasses on, you will see nothing. <laughs> so, so yes, you should absolutely remove your glasses during totality because otherwise you're going to miss getting to see the solar corona. So all of the extended stuff around the sun. Now, it is very important to note this is just for those in the direct path of totality and only during those few minutes. Otherwise, keep those glasses on if you're looking up. Uh, Any time the sun is visible, you have to have the solar eclipse glasses on. Uh, if you don't have them on and you're looking at the sun, you will damage your retina. So do not look uh, any time the sun is visible. Don't do that. Dr. Hankins recommends searching your town for how long you will be in complete totality and setting a timer on your phone to make sure you protect your eyes. If you're still able to see the sun through them, even though you think it's time, leave them on. So you want to basically make sure you see nothing through the glasses when you're looking at the sun uh, when you choose to take them off. So there you go. Of course, hey. this is only for the path of totality. Right. So make sure you have those glasses on. But yes, as you mentioned, during those four minutes, if you're in Russellville or mm -hmm. probably closer to two here in Little Rock, take them off. Look around. Experience it. Experience it. Yeah, yeah. That's going to be the only safe time to do so. And yeah. he does provide a good recommendation of setting a timer on your phone, mm -hmm. but really just using your best judgment, of course, when to put those back on yeah. uh, versus take them off. Uh, you don't want to get solar retinopathy. That's no. just a sunburn yeah. to the no. eyes. No. And, and there are reported <laughs> cases from the last eclipse in 2017 oh, of folks mm -hmm. without glasses is looking up and, and causing some damage. Uh, very few reports. I think most people are sure. really going to be pretty safe, right? Uh, but yeah, you get to take them off. So they're very important to have. They allow you to experience the first couple of phases of the eclipse and some of the special moments all leading up to totality. Yeah. But totality is, is just that. It's going to be dark. Pure yeah. And you get to take them off and enjoy it for, depending on where you're at, mm -hmm. uh, Russellville around four minutes, Little Rock around two. One so week cool. away. Crazy. Hard so, so cool. All right. Hard so rare. Looking forward to it. <laughs>